In the early 18th century, there was a notorious pirate known as Edward Thatch, or Blackbeard. He was a tall man with a long, black beard, which he would often braid and tie slow-burning fuses into before going into battle, giving him the appearance of a demon. He was feared by sailors and merchants alike, as he would stop at nothing to acquire treasure and power. Blackbeard's ship was called the Queen Anne's Revenge, and it was a formidable vessel, equipped with forty guns and a crew of ruthless pirates. He and his men would sail the seas, attacking and plundering any ship that crossed their path. They would take whatever they wanted gold, jewels, weapons, and even food and supplies. No one was safe from Blackbeard and his crew. One day, while sailing the Caribbean Sea, Blackbeard and his crew came across a Spanish galleon, heavily laden with treasure. The pirates eagerly set upon the ship, but the crew of the galleon put up a fierce fight. Blackbeard was not one to back down from a challenge, and he led his men into battle with a fierce determination. After a long and bloody fight, the pirates emerged victorious and claimed the treasure as their own. With their new wealth, Blackbeard and his crew sailed up and down the eastern coast of the American colonies, terrorizing the towns and settlements they came across. They would loot and pillage, leaving destruction in their wake. The people of the colonies lived in fear of Blackbeard and his crew, and many begged for protection from the Royal Navy. Finally, the Navy decided to take action against Blackbeard. A group of naval vessels set out to hunt down the notorious pirate. Blackbeard and his crew put up a fierce resistance, but they were outnumbered and outgunned by the Navy. In the end, Blackbeard was killed in a fierce battle near Ocracoke Island, North Carolina. But even in death, Blackbeard's legend lived on. His name became synonymous with piracy, and tales of his exploits were told for years to come. He was remembered as a fierce and ruthless pirate, who took what he wanted and never backed down from a fight. And even though he is long gone, his spirit still sails the seas, forever a part of the legend of the pirate Blackbeard.